Now, Delta State Governor Ifayakowe has said that there will be no effective rule of law in Nigeria without financial autonomy and the independence of the judiciary system in the country. Governor Okowe made the statement at the Nigerian Bar Association Section on Legal Practices 2022 Annual Conference in Asaba, the state capital. Our Asaba correspondent, Apome Jaro Friday's report, is presented from our studios. Governor Okowe described the theme of the conference, which was legal practice in Nigeria, our reality, our future, as apt as, according to him, it will strengthen the fight for the rule of law and holding the executive arm of government accountable to the principles of fairness, equity and justice. The governor said that his administration would continue to support financial autonomy for the state judiciary, just as the legislative arm. My administration has, and we continue to support the notion that the judicial finance should be held accountable to the principles of fairness, by the executive branch of government in the same manner that the executive and the legislative branches are administered the funds appropriated for their internal operations. This is because there can be no rule of law without the guarantee of independence for the judiciary. On his part, the acting Chief Justice of Nigeria, Justice Ulukayode Ariwola, represented by Justice Abdul Aboki, said the NBA has a burden to ensure that legal practitioners keep to the ethics of the profession. Justice Aboki said the challenges of the legal profession were self-inflicted and also lauded the choice of the conference theme, which according to him was meant to address the challenges facing the profession. The NBA is a former member of all legal practitioners. All of us owe it a duty to contribute our quota to enable it to spare the ideas of the legal profession effectively to the administration form. The SLP has a greater burden to see that legal practice is scrutinized. We are all aware that the administration justice rests on a high point the courts, the litigants, and the legal practitioners who represent parties to the district. The role of legal practitioners and other key holders in the administration of justice was a view to opening up new vistas on how to tackle the challenges relating to legal practice. The movement of the welfare and well-being of our judicial officers, the entrenchment of true independence and financial autonomy of the judiciary as an equal arm of government. Having said that, it is equally important that the judiciary must not only be, but should be seen as being above board and transparent in the management and allocation of the resources currently available to it. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.